yeah what's going on welcome back to another tool review so this one is going to be about the black diamond squeegee rubber available at windowcleaner.com link will be down below so this is the 18 inch soft black uh, cloth pack so there they have two they have the soft and the medium so the soft one is typically good um, is good like year round and whatnot. The hard, the soft, or the medium one is not that is good mostly for like hotter temperatures because you know it softens up a little bit and during the cold, you know your medium rubber, you know gets harder so it's more stiff. So this one, it's good for the the warm weather and the cold. So I, this is the one I bought. This is the cheapest rubber you can buy per you know per per rubber so I think this one's about twenty dollars it's like a dollar a strip so I bought the 18 inch because I have an 18 inch squeegee and I have a 12 inch squeegee so you know one goes fully into one of my squeegees and the other one goes into the um, I just cut it to get to be into the 12 one 12 inch one so I also got this one because I'm gonna eventually buy the Unger Ninja um, squeegee and this rubber fits that channel, so I don't have to buy their proprietary um, rubber. So right now I have it just in this um, Unger squeegee here. So it's in there pretty good. I think it's a little uneven, now, honestly, now that I look at it in the camera. I think I have more on one side. But anyways, it works really good in this one. It's super, like, I think, so the rubber I had before was... Um, now I know is a hard rubber that I just bought from Amazon it was like two dollars a rubber for uh, it was like a four pack for eight bucks so I was just buying that because you know this stuff you go through rubber quick um, but the first time I used this this um, this rubber I was like whoa so it glides really good um, it does I guess the term is called rainbow a little bit so when you squeege when you squeegee, it leaves a little trail that disappears like within seconds, but it does leave a little trail. I don't know if it's because I'm putting too much pressure or if it's just my solution mix. I don't know. But yeah, so it's really good. I th definitely think if you're on a budget and you don't want to buy like, you know, the Unger Green, which is like $8 a rubber, or, you know, if you don't have to buy like the proprietary one, like the Mormons NXT or whatever it's called. Um, rubber I definitely would say pick up and just depending where you're at in the in the country or in the world um, just decide whether or not you need the soft or the medium and again this is the round top so obviously you want to make sure your channel you know what type of channel you have in terms of if you need the flat top or the round top so the round top looks like this I get it to focus Well, as you can see right there, it's like circle. Imagine just like a circle. Um, uh, just imagine a circle, right? The flat top is like a T. So that's how you can tell the difference. Also, this isn't one piece. <laughs> My dumbass thought this was one piece when I first got it. I didn't see the little, the little slit. You just they come apart. So, anyways, obviously don't keep this in your car. Like just in like direct heat. You know you're gonna mess it up. Keep it in a cool place like your house i would assume yeah so if you want if you want to try out um you want to upgrade your rubber to something decent and isn't going to break the bank per rubber give out give them a try and go from there so check them out again i feel this is a really good product i will i can say that you should definitely give this a try it's not that expensive it's 20 dollars roughly um for the 18 inch 12 pack. I don't remember the exact price, but check them out. All right. Till the next one. Peace.